Hey guys, have you noticed your Google Maps uh, rankings have been fluctuating over the past couple of weeks? Let me show you what I've done with one of my clients. We went from first place to 17th place, and now we're back to first place holding steady. Let me show you what I did, and it may work for you. Watch this. Hey guys, if you could please donate to my channel, the link is below. Thank you, Digital X-Ray, for your very, very generous donation. Okay, guys, so if you're watching this video, you're probably frustrated with your Google Maps rankings, meaning that you were on the first place one day, 17th the next, you're coming back to third the next, and you're not sure what's going on. So I created this video to help you in that sense. Okay, we had a client like that. It's right here at a first listing. It's called ProClean Services. Uh, prior to coming on with us, uh, he was dropping and coming back and a lot of fluctuation. And for the most part, he was, um, he was dropped to 16th or 17th place and couldn't come back. So I want to show you what I did for this account. And uh, you could learn from it so you could do it for your account. Okay. The first thing that we did, by the way, this is the account right here in first place. The first thing we did was we took a look at the on-page optimization. All right. On-page optimization means everything that you do on your website to show Google that you're the leader in pressure washing in New Orleans, Louisiana. So what I like to do in all my keyword pages is the first sentence. I like to put, are you looking for a plumber in New York, a pressure washing, are you looking for pressure washing in New Orleans? And then I link that page to the same page. It's, a, it's the same, it, it's going to this page, all right? It's going to the page that we're on. But it's, it's reassuring Google that this page is the page that best explains pressure washing in New Orleans, Louisiana. All right, so that's the keyword that we're going after, pressure washing. That's the clickable phone number for mobile. You'll notice this is the logo. We always use the keyword on the, on the picture. Uh, this is the uh, H1 tag. Okay, we put the Google reviews, we put the map, right? And then this is the H2 tag. The H2 tag, you wanna do a bulleted list. I'm gonna put this page in the description below. So you could just copy the structure. And then this is the H3 tag. The H3 tag has, um, you know, the explanation as to why. Remember, something in Google is uh, when, somebody, when somebody's doing a search in Google, they're looking for the answer for something. So why choose uh, ProClean services? Um, uh, why do you need, why is it especially, why do you especially need pressure washing in, uh, in New Orleans, right? You want to be specific to your area. So... We do that, and then at the end, what I like to do is, what I've been doing lately is just putting a little something about the town, right? So I just go over to Wikipedia, and I find something. I don't copy and paste it. I just read it, and then I summarize it. I put it in a couple of sentences, and then I put a, uh, several of the most popular places around his area, and I just link, I just link to the... Uh, Google Maps, I created Google Maps for each. I link to their Google Maps. I don't create a Google Maps, excuse me. I link to the Google Maps of, of uh, you know, French Quarter and, and so on and so forth. Okay, so that's everything for on-page optimization. That's everything for on-page optimization. Like I said, I'll include this link below in the description box. But here's two more things that we did. So now you have your on-page optimization, which is 80% of SEO, 85%. You could create all kinds of crazy signals off your page, meaning by creating Google Drive stacks and building links and doing press releases. But if 
Your website doesn't say you do pressure washing. It doesn't say it effectively. You're not going to uh, rank well. And that could be another reason for your fluctuation being that Google is testing the page. Does this best answer the question for people who are looking for pressure washing? It'll put it up there for a little while. It'll, it'll monitor whether people are clicking the page, taking a look at it, reading the content. If they're just coming here and clicking off, that is a good reason for fluctuation. Google says, hey, we tested it. We put it up there to see if people like it. They didn't like it. And we dropped it back down to 17th place. So what we did was we fixed up the content and we've been holding steady here for a little while now. The other reason for fluctuation is your citations. What does that mean? Citations are a vote on, on different websites to reassure Google what your name, address, and phone number is, better known as NAP, name, address, and phone number. When you, when you have uh, your website on other popular websites like Apple and like Foursquare and Yelp and YP Yellow and so on, Facebook, so on and so forth, and uh, when you have your name, address, and phone number on those websites, Google says, okay, you're located at 1010 Main Street. Let's throw out a feeler. Let's throw out a big net and see if your name, address, and phone number is exactly the same on other websites. And uh, you want to make sure that if in your Google My Business, it says 1010 Main Street, Suite 100, that your website says 1010 Main Street, Suite 100, your Google My Business says it, and all your citations say Suite 100. And if it says Suite number 100, the number sign, make sure the number sign is there. It has to be exactly the same or as close as possible. All right? So another reason for fluctuation is that Google cannot confirm your address. So I purchased this uh, package from WhiteSpark. It's an alternative to Yext. If anybody's used Yext before, Yext is $1,000 a year. This is a one-time payment of $349. And um, it seems to work. It seems to work. All right. So I'm going to put this in the description box below. And hey, listen, I'm not too proud to say I ordered 12 uh, links to from this fella SEO pool. I'll put his name in the description below. Guy's name is SEO pool. He's a seller on Fiverr. He has some pretty good uh, backlinks. And I purchased 12 backlinks to the pressure washing page, not to the home page, to this specific page. So they wrote a little article and the link they put in was right here. It went back to the pressure washing page. So let's recap. Let's recap. My rankings were fluctuating. They were, they were jumping all over the place. I shored up the content on the website. I made the content on the website better. The second thing is I purchased a better citation package i used one through white spark i'll put the link below and then the third thing it was i had more links and i used this fella called seo pool on fiverr and we pointed the links back to the pressure washing page all right i really hope that helped um i watch a lot of videos and I know that I'm not the best at explain. I, I know that I'm not the best speaker, but I think I'm very good at explaining things, right? Because there's nothing more frustrating than watching a video for 15 minutes and, and being more confused than you were uh, to start, right? So uh, I do have a video on how to write content for your website. If I could find it real quick, I'll put it in the description below and you could watch that video on how to write content because that's the only question that I think you may have is how do I know what good content is? So if I could find that, uh, if I could find that video real quick, I'm gonna put it in the description below. If not, I'll just ask you to please just scroll through my videos and 
and uh, and find it. But I'll, I'll look for it. I'll look for it. Listen, I hope everybody's having a great day. Uh, real important, man. I know everybody's caught in with, with your family. Everybody's sitting in there. Now's the time to really kick it into second gear and really appreciate them. Nobody's getting on your nerves. This is an opportunity to be with your family and be close to your family. And um, that's the thing that's really important. We get to do this uh, website design and this SEO stuff because uh, everybody in our family is doing what they should be doing. And uh, I just want you to appreciate them. And please give them a kiss. Give, give your wife a kiss, your husband a, a kiss. And your kids, give them a hug. Get out there a little bit, throw the ball with them, with them if they if they're, like to play ball. Uh, the weather's getting a little warmer, so try to get outside a little bit, and, uh, and please stay safe. With that, I wish everybody only the best, and uh, good luck in the MAPS rankings. Thanks a lot, guys.